Hi, welcome to the New Jersey Skinny, brought to you by New Jersey Realtors, where we dig into the most recent numbers from our market. Negative housing headlines should be read with calm or skepticism, not alarm. National housing trends, like the steady rise in home prices and decline in inventory, should certainly be observed with care, but tracking wider economic conditions is also necessary. Buyers want to get into the market, but unlike the rising price sales environment of 10 years ago, people are not diving headlong into risky mortgages or uncomfortable situations. This carefulness should be celebrated, not feared. Pending sales increased 25.3% from March 2015 to 10,468 for the month. Bergen County and Ocean County had the most pending sales, while Sussex and Passaic County had the strongest year-over-year gains. Close sales increased 14.7% from March 2015 to 7,025 for the month. Inventory is still a concern, but sales have remained up. The number of homes for sale was down compared to this time last year. Inventory levels market-wide decreased 7.8% to 56,985 units. Ocean County and Atlantic County had the most active listings, while Hudson and Essex counties saw the greatest decreases in inventory. Sellers need to list in order for the market to achieve a better balance. Prices were up slightly compared to last year at this time. The median sales price rose a little, up 0.4% to $255,000. Bergen and Hudson counties had the highest median sales prices in the state. Prices were relatively stagnant, but the market should hit its stride next quarter, and that tends to equate to higher prices. Month supply of inventory was down 21.2%, to 6.7 months. Percent of list price received at sale rose to 96% since last year. Sellers in Essex County and Hudson County received the largest share of their asking price, and Cumberland County had the greatest year-over-year -year increase. Employment figures are positive, wages are going up, and employers are hiring. Consumers are holding for the right deal, even in the face of extremely low mortgage rates. As seller and builder confidence increases, we should see more activity in the second quarter of 2016. The second quarter tends to rank as the best time to list a home for sale, but if inventory stays low, it will be difficult to sustain sales increases in year-over-year -year comparisons. Prices are seemingly not so high as to stall the market completely. Demand is present, but an abundance of choice is not, and therein lies the rub. That's the New Jersey Skinny for this month. Check back next month for the latest.